Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily tarot reading for the 26th. We're just going to see whatever comes up. This is for somebody, not everybody. Maybe it's for you, maybe it's not. Let's just see what we got for the 26th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. Walking away, first card. We get this card a lot now, don't we? We do. Oh. Funny, my hair, my instant hand to chest, um, instant. So you know, um, sorry. Anyhow, walking away, walking away, turning your back on something that doesn't serve you, bringing closure to a situation. Thinking, woman, thinking, 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 thinking. Thinking about closing that book. Thinking about opening another one. In order to do that, you absolutely have to leave something behind. So it looks to me as though somebody's been manifesting change. And they're really thinking about their partnership. Um, they're thinking about their independence. They're thinking about everything that comes with walking away, you know. Um, angel of love. Thinking about love. Absolutely. Ooh. Uh, yikes. Door to romance. Now your prayers have been heard. 3-3. Three, three. There's an opportunity to bring balance and harmony back to your life, perhaps through love. It's like this angel of love. This is love coming. Okay, love is coming. We have this person here that is thinking about accepting it, thinking about offering it, or thinking about giving up their independence, you know, or thinking about walking away. What am I going to do here? What am I going to do? Um, storm warning, yes, be prepared. Storm is a brewing. Uh, yikes, you know, there is a storm brewing with a storm warning. Something is going to happen that maybe you don't expect. Uh, maybe you you think it's not gonna be. Maybe you think it's. Not, maybe you think there is no storm coming, and there really is a storm coming. So just beware. Um, this converts to a one. This converts to your thoughts. Um, independence, highly intuitive at this time. So be be re be really aware of your thoughts too, as well. Somebody is really doing a lot of thinking. Be careful because your thoughts truly do become things. You've been thinking about love. You've been praying for love. Maybe it's coming and now, now it takes you by storm. <laughs> that could certainly be the case. Blossoming abundance. Another three. So yeah, your prayers have definitely been heard. They have been. Yep, yep. Angel of strength. So, woman holding heart. Uh oh. The world. We have a new beginning here. We do have a new beginning here. Beginning of love. It's like all of a sudden the door is opening. The door is open. And now somebody has to have the strength. They need to find the strength and the courage to actually walk through that door. You know, they have to, you know, you want it or not. Because now you're presented with the opportunity. You know, we have somebody here that is really opening their heart, give, ready to give their heart away. And it's like... <laughs> financial constraints at the end of this. Make sure that this is zoomed or focused, whatever you want to call it. You know, maybe it's walking away from independence, okay? Some of you may be, uh, you know, about to give up your independence and maybe you are receiving some sort of blessing, you know, disguised as a storm. Um, I feel as though it could be a little um, uncomfortable. You could be dealing with um, a lot of thoughts. I mean, you think about storm. Storm is in the air. It's, it's wind, you know. There's a lot of thinking going on. A lot of thinking about perhaps giving up independence or becoming independent. It could go both ways. 
I really feel as though somebody is, is uh, <laughs> being given an opportunity to fall in love, honestly. I mean, that's what this is. We have a new love connection here. It is new. It is new with the world card. This is a new beginning. It's like... Uh, starting over that's what I see this is starting over it is but you're gonna have to find the strength and the courage to face your fears about giving your heart away there's there's some kind of connection that has come about that has been brought to you from above okay because of these angels here it's been brought to you from above and now you have to make this decision are you ready are you ready are you ready for this love because this is what you've been asking for it is Somebody has been asking for this, and now it's here. It's, it's looking you right in the face. And I feel as though somebody may feel like they don't have enough to offer, or they may feel like they don't have time for it. But now you're faced with the aftermath of this connection. It's like there is a love connection here. There's a love connection here. There is. And now, you know, you have to decide, do you want it or not? That's what this is. There's an opportunity for a lot of abundance here. I think something has grown. I think a love connection has grown. And now it's a little scary. I do. I think it's scary. Um... Let's get some more cards. We're going to use a different deck. You know, what do you want? What do you want? That's, that, that is the question here. Do you want to walk away from this abundance, this, this, this wish fulfillment? Do you want to walk away from it? Are you too scared? Are you too scared to accept love? Because it's like there's a, there's a love connection here that is brought to you from above. But it looks like somebody is considering walking away because of fear. Maybe you have to walk away from something to get the abundance that you deserve. For some of you, you have to completely walk away and not look back. There is an opportunity for love to blossom, but somebody is really holding themselves back. It's like the door is open. There's butterflies. There is butterflies here. There's butterflies, and there's a feeling of this feels too good to be true. And somebody may be trying to protect themselves by burying themselves in everything but love. But feeling the love and they're thinking about walking away because they may think that they don't have enough to offer. They just don't have time for or whatever the case is. But I have to tell you that I think there's some upheaval on the way. Unfortunately, with this storm warning, there is some sort of upheaval that is coming that is probably going to... Well, let's get a card to go with that and see what what's, what that is. Break the barrier. It is gonna. It's gonna. It's gonna break. It's gonna break right through the barrier. It is. So I feel like it's like this is hitting you like a tornado. You know, it's like it's hitting you hard. It's hitting you hard. I think this love connection is hitting somebody really hard. It is definitely something that somebody has manifested. I feel like it's gonna force somebody to take action. I think that there's there's a, a hard hit here, definitely, um, and which forces some sort of change. I mean, the magician is willing to shed his old, old ways to bring in something new, forces somebody to take action. So I feel like there is action that is going to be taken because of the hit, you know, the feeling, the... the
Yeah, it's definitely because of the feeling. I can't I can't sit here and hide anymore. I can't hide. I can't hide my feelings anymore. It's like it's here, it's facing, it's right here. You can't hide from it, you can't run from it. So I really feel as though <laughs> somebody is about to take action. They're gonna find those those resources within them. They're gonna use the tools that they have to overcome this hit, whatever it is. Um, judgment reversed. You may not be aware. <laughs> There's lack of awareness, lack of faith. You may not even see this coming. You may not, you may not see this come something, or you may not have seen it coming, put it that way. You may not have thought this was gonna turn into love. You may not have thought this was gonna this was gonna hit you the way it did, but here it is. Here it is. I feel as though Somebody has manifested a new beginning in love. It's like they've, they've, they've got a new love here. They didn't see it coming. They did not see it coming. And, and now it's like, boom. That's what I see. It's like, boom. Um, it could lead to something solid, stable, and secure. This is, this is blossoming abundance. Absolutely. This is a, a, a very, um, could lead to marriage, could lead to commitment, could lead to something uh, that you can really, really build on. Hmm. Something somebody has waited for. It's the, somebody has received an, an answer to their prayers. It may not, you know, they may have thought that they were never going to get it. <laughs> you know, it's like they never, they thought that they were never going to get this, but here it is. All of a sudden it's here. It's like, and it didn't, it's not when you thought it was going to happen, right? It's like, it's just all of a sudden it's here. It's not something you can hide from it. The connection is so real that you can't, you can't run from it. You can't hide from it. I feel like somebody is looking at a very stable, solid, uh, prosperous opportunity and they're going to need to find the strength and the courage to allow this love into their lives there may be some fear of rejection there may be some fear of getting hurt Yeah, there is. There's there's fear of trying to protect, trying to seven of swords, fear of being cheated, fear of getting hurt, um, fear of biting off more than you can chew. I really feel as though there's an opportunity to Drop the burdens of the past and start over again with that world card. This decision that somebody is making is, is very, it's overwhelming. Somebody is overwhelmed. They're overwhelmed with their feelings. They're overwhelmed with their fears. They're overwhelmed with the connection. Seriously. It's like this is overwhelming. It is. It's like this is somebody has got caught. It's like they've gotten caught in love. <laughs> that's what it looks like to me. It's like that's what this is. It's like this is this is love and now I'm caught up in it. Now I've gotten caught up in love. You know? And it's like this is what I wanted. This is what I wished for. But now I'm overwhelmed with this feeling. Empress on the bottom. There's an op this is Taurus or, Vir or uh, I was going to say Virgo, but I meant to say Libra. Could be anybody else, but um, this is the goddess of love. So th love, she brings love. She does. She's all about love. In abundance, 
So this, there is absolutely a new love connection here that could grow into something stable, solid, secure, long-term, very prosperous, um, could lead to marriage. And we have somebody here that is overwhelmed and fearful and scared to give it a chance. They're scared to give it a chance because it's just, such, it's just a shock. It is a shock. I think they're shocked by the feelings. I feel as though we have a beginning. I mean, the world card with the Empress, this is a new beginning. So there's a beginning, a brand new beginning in love. Brought to you from above. I mean, with these angels, that's, that's what this is. It's like it's right in front of you. Right, right, right in front of you. Well, not much more to say. I mean, it is what it is. This is a new opportunity for love with somebody that, you know, you didn't expect. You didn't expect this. It's, it's a hard hit. It's like it hit you fast. It hit you right in the face. It's like boom. You may have expected it to take time. You may have expected, you know, it to uh, not manifest as quickly, but... It's not the way it went. Um, so all of a sudden, all of a sudden, there's butterflies, there's feelings. And it's hard. It's a hard hit. It's like a slap right in the face, a wake-up call. It is a wake-up call. It's like, boom, you're in love. It's a miracle. It is. It's a blessing. It is a blessing. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Stay. And for those of you that this is not for, this is a message. Stay optimistic. Think positive. Somebody has manifested a new love connection. There's no doubt. A new beginning. They've learned some sort of lesson in the past. It's over. That burden has been dropped. Somebody here is overwhelmed, though. Somebody is overwhelmed with their heart, with their feelings. It's like it's overwhelming. It's like, oh, my God, how did this happen? Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take. That's a good message, isn't it? We have somebody here who is very nurturing, caring, loving, kind, beautiful, abundant. This is this is the this is a, a very creative individual. This is a creator. She creates things. She brings abundance to herself and to everybody around her because she has this way about her. She brings beauty to every situation because she can grow anything. So we have somebody here that has or is giving birth to a new life, a new beginning here. We have a major new beginning in love. I mean, that's what I got to say about today. Is there communication coming in? I would say so. I would say so, considering this connection is so strong. True love. I could have told you that. This is the romance of a lifetime. This is a romance. This is the romance of a lifetime. Brought to you straight from above. It's what you have been wishing for. This reading is for somebody I don't know who. It's like a it's like a it's like a like I said, it's a hard hit.
chemistry, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. It's undeniable. It is undeniable. There's a lot of love to be had. And I think that there's such a strong connection that, you know, here we go. So that's what I have today. Nothing more to say. This is the fourth reading I've done <laughs> for the Daily Vibes. Um, I am this thinking woman. So, uh, <laughs> somebody else is too, obviously. Thinking about new life, thinking about the new beginning, thinking about the blessing, thinking about the miracle. But what's the advice? <laughs> I think we need another card, don't you? What is the advice? Let's get one of these. What's the advice for this whole situation? Restrain yourself? <laughs> oh, God. The angel of strength. That's why I said that. Strength is about restrain yourself. Just restrain yourself. Let go of fear. You think about strength. Let go of fear. You know, let go of fear. There's nothing to be fearful of, right? Oh, God. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. There we get a jeez, I'm crow out of that one. Passion and pleasure. You should put that one away. Um, savor your life. Savor your life. Right. <laughs> Find joy in the moment. No matter what is occurring in your life, if you simply focus on what is splendid, wonderful, and pleasurable in the moment, everything improves. Live deliciously. Love often and live fully. Cherish your friendships. Fill your life with the people, experiences, and places that give you delight and joy. Let go of those people and things that don't appreciate and empower you. That's the walking away card. Walk away to receive your blessing. And don't keep looking back. Anyhow. Let go of those people and things that don't appreciate and empower you. Give yourself permission to be happy. Oh my goodness gracious. When the traveler meets a band of gypsies, the traveler stops to dance in the early morning hours. Sometimes we get so caught up with wondering what's around the next bend and worrying about our current challenges that we forget to focus on what's great in the moment. You're not meant to simply work hard and be diligent and practical. Embrace pleasure wherever you can. Allow your senses to be satiated, satiated. Allow your senses to be dealt with. <laughs> Find and explore the beauty around you. You don't need to suffer to grow. You can grow spiritually by leaps and bounds through joy. Dance, eat well, and drink well, and share joy wherever you can. This card goes with the last reading I just did, which I'm probably not going to share because I figured it was for me. But I obviously that it was, I don't know, this is for somebody. This is for the collective. Um, I think that somebody has been hit really hard. And, you know, <laughs> there's fear. So um, I'm here to tell you what this card just said. Allow. Don't fight it. Stay optimistic. Make the effort. This is the romance of a lifetime. Don't let what walked away from you keep you stuck. You deserve love. You deserve this blessing. You deserve this new life. I feel as though some sort of truth is going to come out. Some sort of truth. Some sort of, you know, with the seven of swords, the truth is going to come out. 
The true feelings are going to come out. Good luck. I'm not sharing the other one, so don't ask.